Hello and welcome to Tabletop Oddity. My name is Jay and uh, today we're bringing you some Star Wars Legion news and the reason I'm being a little bit quieter than usual is that it's 1am in the UK. Um, Kate is in bed in a different room and I don't want to speak ridiculously loud but I stayed up to watch the FFG in-flight report from um, Gen Con. They've just had their live talk and they've announced some well, pretty huge things. Um, for X Wing as well, um, but I'm this video. I'm going to be looking more mostly at the Legion stuff. So what have they announced? Well, we've got Chewbacca uh, as the operative with some Wookies. I was wrong. I thought we'd get um, like Obi Wan or something like that. Um, we got Chewbacca as an operative. Pretty good. Pretty happy. Fantastic. We got um, some a unit of specialists which is basically a generic leader and some droids, like um, that kind of thing. Fantastic, that's coming later. And then the massive, 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 massive news is that the Clone Wars factions, the good and the evil side, um, are coming to both Star Wars Legion and X-Wing. I mean, that is mind-blowingly good. Yeah, they're only going to talk about it maybe in November. Uh, it's only going to come out maybe like halfway through next year, but two new factions, that is massive news so let's i mean I can, there's not much i can like really show you because um well i don't want to show somebody else's feed from the event and um, because it's not mine i and i haven't asked anybody uh, so i'll show you twitter and uh, what we do have on the old twitter um if i'm looking at the right thing well we have got well this is the wookies we're getting an article tomorrow uh, probably come back and have a proper chat just about the wookies um and Chewbacca because it's probably worth it but for now this is all we, well we've got this and his box so he's uh, an operative so he is basically the counter to Boba Fett in that sense I was expect expecting maybe a counter to Palpatine that was wrong <laughs> so that's fine um, and we're getting a unit of Wookiees with him uh, which are going to be the elite bash your facing kind of guy so um definitely interesting there and then something that um, I was hoping for droids I actually mentioned it um, on Twitter and Facebook and stuff um, and we're getting it the best part about this to me is the generic leader um, you literally get in a generic commander who has three generic um, command cards that anybody can take um, and you just get yeah, it's just generic so they're going to be cheap they're not going to have like all the special rules and there's droids Um there's four miniatures coming with them Um I can't exactly show them to you but uh, there's four miniatures there I, I quite like the fact that the lady uh, it's a lady for the um, Imperials it's nice to have um, but the same kind of thing four people you get four people with them and they do like a variety of different stuff basically generic commander and I presume the droids will be like a support unit um, but interesting and then there's <laughs> there's literally nothing to show <laughs> for this um i don't think there's even an image at the moment no there's not even an image um no but they do say where do they say it they say the clone wars are coming um where is it uh big <laughs> sorry it says big news second edition um and star wars legion are coming to the clone wars era um, and basically on the screen in the talk it's just Clone Wars, talking about the TV show, Star Wars, Le well, Star Wars Legion, X-Wing, two new factions coming for Legion, um, so the Galactic Republic and the Confederacy, Confeder uh, Confederacy of Independent Systems. As um, CJ Johansson says, thank you, thank you. That is massive news for a variety of reasons, um, but mainly, mainly because... Um, well, I didn't expect us to get factions. I want, and these this is the perfect faction for me because the droids and stuff like that are so cool, um, just so cool looking, and I'm like so excited about those this specific era. Um, like the films maybe not have been that great, but the aesthetic of it was incredible, if you ask me. Um, and yeah, well, I thought we need new factions because people are saying um, they can't keep up with the releases. Well, you can't keep up with the releases because there's only two factions and anything that comes out you have to like buy and paint to sort of be up to date um whereas if there's factions that you aren't playing then you don't have to buy and paint everything so they can do releases for other factions and your friends might be like i'm buying that and you can just sit back and be like great i'll see how i can beat that so new factions i think were 
uh, desperately, desperately needed. Um, and it's I'm very happy to see that they're um, not hanging around with these new factions. Obviously, we'll get First Order and stuff like that in the future. Oh, there's a little fire, then I don't know if you could see it. Um, and uh, yeah, I thought they wouldn't do it this early because there's still quite a lot. There's still quite a chunk you could do with the original trilogy, but they're doing it, and um, I'm pretty damn happy about it. Um, I don't. There's not really much. Just I think they said that it would come in. Um, uh, they would talk more about it in November, so we don't actually have too much from it. I'm just. I did write some notes. I just want to double check that. Um, no, it just says uh, Q4 for the Wookiee and Chewbacca. The Rebel Specialist and the Imperial Specialist contains droids, generic commanders and new command cards. I said all that. So we that that's everything there is uh, at the moment. Um, on the Wookiee side of things, I thought that, you know, that was pretty, um, pretty obvious that that was coming. Uh, the droids and stuff, yeah, I thought we... You know, we sort of knew that was a possibility. I think we, there was talk of treaded vehicles. I'm sort of hoping that's a Clone Wars era thing, um, but I'd happily get that in the original uh, trilogy as well. Um, yeah, like, it's it's late at night. I'm tired. I can't really put together my thoughts properly, but um, that's what it is. Tomorrow, we'll, I'll come back and we'll talk about the uh, Wookiee, uh, we'll, the Wookiee and Chewbacca, and we'll do the actual article. Um that I'll have like his stats and his points and all that kind of stuff so we'll come back and do that um but yeah I stayed up late just to to see it's all it's also coming to X-Wing um which I'd seen like Crabock had speculated about it and it sort of made sense because um there's a new TV series being made um called well it's not a new TV series that's a lie it's a new season of the TV series called Clone Wars there is another one called mm, the resistance i think um but yeah there's a new uh, a new season of it like a, fina a final season so um i wouldn't that is obviously twisted ffg's hand in that sense um but yeah absolutely uh, incredible news very happy about it um I, I actually couldn't ask for more i think um I, somebody asked me on the discord and the star wars leading discord like what do you want and at the top of the list i was like new factions droids wookie <laughs> Um, I actually sort of wanted like a faction of like Mandalorians or something, but um, I'll take this. This is fantastic as well. Um, yeah, well, let me know your thoughts. Is this gonna? Does this maybe alleviate any concerns you had with Legion? Are you like? Are you just over the moon? I'm over the moon. Like, the droid models are gonna be so cool. Um, I'm just so excited to see that and consider that. Um, yeah, let me know your thoughts. How excited are you? Are you more excited about this in Legion or X-wing? Or are you not bothered either way? Um, and you're just going to happy keep beating the rebels with your, um, you know, the Empire. <laughs> so, yeah. Have a... Right, I mean, if you like this video, do like. If you want to keep up to date with news, I go out of my way <laughs> to try and get this as, on as quickly as possible. I stayed up late. Um, the quality of the video is perhaps a bit lacking because I'm so tired. But like and subscribe if you do want to keep up to date with this kind of stuff. Um, and you should always, always have a most beautiful day. And uh, yeah, that's it. H have a nice night. Goodbye. Bye, guys.